Hi everybody, hope you're well. This video was requested by Cantering Banners and also by Melissa L. So I'm going to kind of be talking a little bit more about the World Championship because a couple of people have said they found this really confusing. So there's a couple of things I've worked out from it. The glitch from earlier seems to have been fixed. Um, so I left a couple of horses here that I already did the platinum of the tails on and left them for a while so that people could groom them for me so they'd be encouraged and I wouldn't need to spend tickets on encouraging them. Um, so that's what I'm going to do now is actually enter them in the races. So uh, we'll participate these ones and then what I'm going to do is enter some other ones from scratch. So that has actually gone into the competition this time and it looks like I've got 55 points. Okay, so I don't know if I can like enter the same horses again so I'm going to check to see that in a minute. Uh, what's the best one? This one seems to be the best one for this one. So... Uh, let's see. I also found, well, a few of you were saying that they, it seems to pick your highest skilled horses. I think that's, I think that's right because I haven't really seen anything else so far. It hasn't been picking any of my really low horses, been picking my skillers. Now some of my skillers are really old, but uh, some of them are still higher than my blops. And this one here is a blop actually, but I'm going to enter it in anyway. So, um... See, the competitions are a little bit lower this time with this guy. So that is in there. So we've got 133 points. Uh, okay, so we can see how many places are available for other people to enter and the results that we've had so far. So we got fifth with Jack and we got third with Midnight Rainbow. Um, I can't help any friends at the moment, but I did uh, do that earlier in an earlier video. So I'm going to click choose again. So I actually can choose the same horse again, which is nice. I actually, I like that. I like that I can do that. So at least that's not so bad. I did figure out one thing though, whenever I was doing this earlier, I, when I was on another server, I decided to click outside of the circles to see what would happen. It actually started to undo my progress. So the plot became undone. So you need to make sure that you're clicking in the circles. Otherwise it'll start to undo the plot on you, which, uh, isn't particularly useful because I started um, just messing around and clicking anywhere just to see what would happen and then the plot got undone and I had like six seconds left and I don't know how um, I managed to do that. So you can use tickets to encourage and the preparation but it's just easier to ask for help and leave it. I think really what I'm finding with this is if you can do this in the morning and then leave it because you've got uh, 12 hours there for somebody to probably um, encourage your horse for you. So there's plenty of time to leave them to do that. Um, and I don't enter them into a competition until they've been encouraged. Because I, th I think it's probably the same in principle as any other um, competition. If you put your horse in before you get the bonuses, then it's not going to have the bonuses. Even if you uh, get the bonuses after. So let's go and pick some more horses to put in. So I think we can re-enter some of them so let's choose midnight rainbow again to put in to another race so yeah you can use tickets for this but it's probably just easier although i can see why this would get really tedious um i'll also have another look at uh, some other parts of this i have to say this is quite a messy plot it's kind of even on one side and not so much on the other. So there we go. And encouragement, so we'll ask for help there. So you are going to need to have friends added to do that. And I'll leave those for a moment. Um, so as far as I can make out, you can get you get six tickets in order to put your horse into the competitions um, for each leg of the race. And that lasts for 12 hours. So there'll be between one o'clock and you know p.m. till one a.m. and then there'll be another leg, as far as I know. So I think there'll probably be another leg after one o'clock in the morning, like UK time. So that's what I think is happening. So I also was reading um, something about uh, the horses of the zodiac, which I'll have a look at in another video. So so far I've not find this too hard. I kind of like it. It's kind of laid back. I don't feel like there's a huge amount of pressure. I think yes it's going to be difficult if you haven't got some high skilled horses. This is supposed to be an easier um, like this is this this promo is supposed to take less passes. This is what I've been hearing. I don't know if it'll be true or not but the, apparently they want to see if um, 
having for less passes, whether how that affects, I guess, people's morale about it and their um, interest in it. Uh, personally, I'm actually really happy that we've got these Zodiac horses because I just feel like I can like not care and not like uh, worry too much. So I'll participate with them again because they've been looked after. Um, go with this one again. Might actually be better entering something slightly lower with him. See if he'd do better. Because maybe he'll go against horses with less skills. That that could work actually. Let's just try that theory. <laughs> it's probably a stupid idea, but we'll see. Um, so we've got some pendant ones there at the moment. Um, so if you want to help a friend, you just click confirm and then you then you stroke it. I'm not overly thrilled with the prizes themselves. But I have to say that I don't really feel like I am bothered about getting these um, star signs. I might get my own star sign just because. Um, I think that would be nice to have, maybe. But I think I don't really want to bother with them overall. Um, so that's really it for now. I hope this kind of helps a couple of people understand this a little better. So basically, you enter those six horses that you choose and you could enter if you just have one good horse you could in theory enter that good horse six times during the day and get the points from that and every time you obviously get um, enough points then you'll reach a new prize and so forth so that, like if I once I get to 200 points then I'll get the points from my ranking and a whip and eventually the aim is to get to there so that is kind of how this works at the moment so the, it obviously will switch up i expect to see that these will change obviously because it says today's competition is for a hunter so obviously it's going to switch around a bit so people with different horses with different skill sets so it's going to you know it's going to um, be a little bit fairer uh, maybe i do think like obviously um just play to your strengths with this one uh so if you have a horse that's good in these three under here pick a horse that's good in those three Definitely. So that is kind of my thoughts on this and just a little bit um, of understanding for it and so forth. I mean, earlier the reason I couldn't enter was because it was glitching out and they fixed that. So as far as I know, it's all sorted now. So anyway, guys, uh, thank you to Counter Vanners and also to Mil Melissa L and hope you'd love your day.